All right, I'm ready to do the next step um, with my repositional Caterpillar shirt. I ironed the bottom again, just kind of touch it up, make sure it's smooth. It's still starched because I starched that when I did the whole, you know, top of the shirt. Um, so now what I do is I do the same thing. I got my hoop. I put my um, tear away stabilizer. I did my dots. Can you see them? You know, with the grid, put the grid in, did the dots, same step. I ironed it. I'm going to turn it inside out. There's that. I can see some dots coming through. So I've got my permanent stabilizer here. So I'm going to just kind of eyeball it. where I think it needs to go. This is also, you, know, you can just reverse it. Let's see, I was going to put it in the wrong place. There. Get that down. Get your iron on. Wrong side. The right side. Iron it on. It'll hold that stabilizer in place. Turn it inside out. Really gently. All right. You're going to line it up again. Make sure that it is where you want it. Yeah, that looks great. Now I'm going to get my pin. I'm going to get my grid. Put the pin in the grid. slide this in first. Now this time I'm going to turn it because it's going to go into my machine sideways so I can get this name nice and long. Okay, So put it in your shirt and I've got my little lines so I'm just going to kind of eyeball it. It's just easier than chasing the shirt. Okay, now Where'd my pin go? There it is. I got my pin. I'll put it through my shirt. I'm going to put it through my hoop. Line it up with my dots. Pull out any shirt that got trapped. flat spot on my ironing board. Make sure y'all can see what I'm doing. Okay. Pull out the shirt again. I always do that. Okay. Now, it's horrible golly wombard. I'm just going to start lining up my notches. Keep checking with the center. There. Make sure y'all can see. Okay. Now I don't see my lines. I raise up the grid and I'm right on them, so hey, that's pretty good, eh? Alright, now also you can see with your shirt in the grid, it's pretty. I mean, you can use your green lines that you've got and line it up with whatever design. In this case, my four, I'm lining it right up and it's, you know, there's equal distance up here on the four and um, the bottom line it looks level. I don't like my hash mark down there is off. So 
Where's my caterpillar? Did I do it off? Alright, let's see if I did all three a little off on the bottom. Nope. Alright, in that case, I'm just going to keep working with it. I'm trying to feel and find those notches, and that's the problem right there. See? That notch in the top was not centered at all. So I was just about to think I was done. Just move your shirt over. Just make slow changes and you'll get it. Check again. And it's so hard to see it through the shirt, through the stabilizer. time-consuming part, so I'm not going to rush it. Feel free to fast-forward me. Very happy with that. Just about spot on lines. Alright, so I'm gonna lift it real gentle. Stick that first pin. And well, here we go again. Make sure we're all good. Yep. Alright, then I'm gonna lift it. Always get myself with the pin. Smooth it. Make sure there are no wrinkles in the fabric. Sometimes it does move. And it did. I think. Let me check it. I hear somebody crying. What's wrong, baby? Jeff bought me again. What happened? He broke in. Hmm? He bought me right in my stomach. I don't like Alright, so it shifted. I'm going to unhoop it. Figure out what this fight was about, and I'll be back. 